back. Few artists can lay claim to international success spanning three whole decades. But since his first hit in 1975, Christa Berg has now sold more than 45 million albums Worldwide. Goodness. Well, his latest collection is called Footsteps and covers classics like the Beatles' We Can Work It Out and Don McLean's American Pie. Well, Chris is here. Good morning. Morning. Uh, let's have a listen then to the new single. Oh, nice good stuff. morning, Chris. Fantastic good stuff. Morning. Well, tell us about this new album because it's an album of covers. Yeah, I've, I've written and recorded more than 200 songs and uh, decided the time had come, rather than looking up at the next project, to look back at um, the songs that have inspired me. Uh, in the early years, songs that I, I learned from and um, things that I still love to sing, like you know the one you just heard, Turn, 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 and where did that come from? Oh. What is that? <laughs> got a guitar, guitar here. Amazing. Uh, well, for example, there's the, this kind of stuff. Uh, yeah. The long and winding road that leads to your door I've seen that road before It always leads me here Lead me to your door Ah, beautiful stuff. Lovely. And you first sang that, uh, was it singing in your dad's restaurant? Uh, yeah, well I was brought up in this old castle, <laughs> sounds romantic but it was extremely cold and um, my grandfather General de Berg bought the place and in the summer months we had it as a hotel so you know in the evenings there wasn't much going on, a bit of TV, uh, that was in the future but uh, I, I was just the, 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 sort of the singer so I'd sort of bye bye Miss American bye, that kind of stuff and those are the songs that I brought on this record because they really took me back and the nice thing about it is for some people, these are new songs. For, for many people, um, they are familiar from, you know, like, for example. No, I can't forget this evening. Oh, your faces are leaving. But I guess that's just the way the story goes. Without you. I mean, great, great song. And I recorded everything live in the studio with an orchestra. And um, my son, Hubie, played this one. Blackbird singing in the dead of night. He played the guitar on that. And when I, the whole album this week. <laughs> <laughs> That's right, we have time. And I'm going on tour in the UK, starting yeah. at the end of the month in Liverpool, and um, Birmingham, Manchester, Royal Albert Hall. First time I've played that with an orchestra, because um, it's an orchestra tour and band, and Bournemouth and mm. Gateshead and sort of Not things. Scotland. We've had an email in from someone saying, we miss you in Scotland. When are you coming here? I'm so sorry. I will be back. I will return. <laughs> when you come to record these songs that you know so well, though, Yeah. Do you feel, is there pressure on you to say, I've got to deliver something different, something that makes it fresh, than, fresher than the original? Because you're fighting a battle against the original. In, well, in to sense. be honest, when they're so good, the originals, I don't mess with that. Like, for example, I've done a cover of Africa by Toto, and I've stayed as close to it as possible. I mean, it's such a sensational tune. But just give it a bit of a modern birthday makeover sort of thing. Mm. Do you change the harmonies, though? Because I, I thought Sometimes. I noticed in, in Turn, Turn, yeah. there's, there's, a sort of, there's a Christa Berg harmony there, rather yeah. than the Bird's harmony. Well, the, the one that we really went sort of slightly different on was All Along the Watchtower, the Bob Dylan song. Um, rather than the sort of the Jimi Hendrix, Bob Dylan version, I've made it much more spacey, a bit more like a movie. Mm. And Lady in Red, of course, um, which so many people know you for, is that a song that you just think now, actually, I'd quite like to leave, leave that behind? Do you still enjoy performing Not it at as all. much as you Not do? Not at all. Here we go. I've never seen you looking so lovely as you did tonight. Lady in Red. How many times do you think you've sung that song? <laughs> How many times have you done this programme? I don't know, hundreds, thousands. But the thing is, you know, if you go to a concert and you're expecting to hear the hits and, and uh, it'd be disappointing, I think. I don't have a problem with that. The thing is, I, I, as I say, I've written a lot of songs like Don't Play the Ferryman and rock uh, hits. Like High and Emotion was the number mm. one in many countries and that's a good old stonker. But Lady in Red just seems to have hit a chord worldwide. Yeah, absolutely, Well, because mm. it, was, it was a massive hit. In terms of what you play on the tour, though, now, is it going to be mostly... Well, you're going to mix it up, the, the old songs and the old, old songs. Absolutely. You know, we'll be doing stuff from Footsteps and uh, also stuff like, um, you know, from the past, from <laughs> the immense canon of work that I've... Yeah. That's four decades, my God. That's a I've long been, time. Yeah, it is, yeah. <laughs>
And, and we just saying, so you're two kicks off, 27th of April in Liverpool. Liverpool is a very, very special yes. place in your heart. Huge yeah. fan, of course, in a special day, very much so. today. As yeah, to, well, um, today is obviously the, the 20th anniversary of Hillsborough. And, and if I may um, for completely forget about what happened last night at Stamford Bridge, but if I may just mm. sing um, well, just a little in, bit of a In tune. one second, that would be very nice because it mm. will be a, a, a special yeah. moment. But uh, do, you have, do you remember where you were that day? I was watching on TV. Mm. And it, it was having, you know, when you're a small guy like me and you are going to a rugby match or a football match and you do get into that crush, it's terrifying. And particularly when you have children. And I've been to the Memorial many times at Anfield and it's, it's, it's very hard not to cry, to be honest, because you see the ages, 15, 17, 10, 8, 21. I mean, it's just, it's horrible, really mm. horrible what happened. Well, thanks very much for coming to see us. Good mm. luck with the tour. And I know you want to play us out with your own personal. Well, you know what? I, I think a cappella might be the way to do this one. For the people of Liverpool who've suffered with dignity and strength, it's for you. When you walk through a storm, hold your head up high and don't be afraid of the dark at the end of a storm. There's a golden sky and the sweet silver song of a lark. Walk on through the wind, walk on through the rain, though your dreams be tossed and blown. Walk on, walk on with hope in your heart and you'll never walk. Alone, you'll never walk alone.